Right, hey guys, Trif Quichelio here today with, and we're back with End of the Effing World, episode 5. So far, the show's impressed me a lot more than I thought it was going to. Like like I say, I thought it was going to be a lot less story-focused than it actually is. I thought it was just going to be more of a dark comedy and be humorous. But no, it's actually got a little story going on. I'm actually quite enjoying it. Um, Alyssa's moved, um, ran away from James again. They're probably going to reunite soon. But, yeah, they've sort of just split their ways for a bit, so it's going to be fun to see him on their own in the world. Um, especially James, I'm just how he's going to handle it. I love how James is a psych... He started off as a psych psychopath, but he's slowly grown to the psychopath, but he's not actually, and I like that, that they've done that with his character. He's got that idea of himself, but he's not actually a full psychopath because he does have feelings and he does care. And that surprised me, and I like what they're doing with the show. I don't know, the show is it's not like the most fucking like best written show ever but it's a lot of fun and that's why i like it. and i just get enjoyment out of it and for me if a show gives me enjoyment it could be the most trashiest writing ever but i still fucking enjoy it as long as i'm enjoying it, that's all that matters and this has got a bit of quite good writing and it's quite funny um when it wants to be when it's trying to do its dark humor but it's actually got quite a little bit of a nice story going on nice and compact and we really got until it's only eight episodes so i've not actually got that much longer of it so yeah i'm enjoying it so far guys but guys if you're enjoying this please make sure you like subscribe always makes me want to always helps me out massively and i always appreciate it make sure you subscribe as well guys i'm doing other shows like dark which is absolutely fantastic if you haven't watched that watch it and things like brooklyn 99 and i've just started the boys so yeah love to have you after those as well let's jump into this reaction i love how the younger james looks way more sadistic than our older one Should just drive off. If you're going to run away, you could do it when you drop your son at home. Oh, suicide! Oh, just commit suicide. Did they mention that? Wow. I can't remember to mention the mum and dad. I've even just really for just forgot. Well, fuck me. This is the problem when you watch shows weekly. I just forget. Thanks for coming in, sir. When did this happen last time? Eleven years ago. I wonder if this is the uh, first time he's talked about it. That to awkwardly get yourself out of situation. Um, no. Is she at work? Uh, she's dead. Oh, sorry. Putting up memory to the poor guy. Oh, I still remember the quote from last really? episode. like, now oh, I know why my dad surrounded himself with noise. Does anyone want a cup of tea? The silence takes over. I was, I was fucking sad for his dad. I feel bad for him. My wife's quit suicide and now his son's one missing. Kettle's on. Did you find his girlfriend then? Oh, period. That's not great. The wife, answer, please. Whew. This guy's so controlling. That's not my daughter. Not my problem. What an ass. She's your daughter in connection with a murder. Oh, my God. She's not a suspect. Not at the moment. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I love how straightforward the award is. Didn't you think the reporter is missing? A boyfriend's dad reported him. Do you have one? Oh, shit. I didn't even think of that. upstairs. Defensive. Recommend Childline or the NSPCC. See, the mum does love her, but she's just so obsessed with her fucking yeah, boyfriend. It. Thanks. Got someone else who can look after you. No. Okay. Love so I actually like her. Do. I ship. I ship the little psycho. So, Even though he's not. So I'm gonna need a few. Maybe he's gonna go crew find Alyssa. Young 
top thief. She's gonna get stuck, didn't she? Not going Nick one. I'm on a fast day. Oh. Got you a drink. It's quite a little funny cop to her. Yeah. I think we should clear the air. Just hear me out. I, I think it's more professional. Look. At least they're really in a relationship. People get drunk and stuff happens in the night that maybe wouldn't happen in the day. And just because that comes as a surprise, it doesn't necessarily mean it's a bad thing. Intense. I love how he's slowly growing emotions. Aww. He's adorable. From good old stepdad, that's for sure. Wait, what? I don't want to have sex with you, even if you pay me. I don't want to have sex with you. I have sex. With my wife. <laughs> what loyal guy. Respects, man. Respects. <laughs> that would be me. <laughs> I can't no, say I wouldn't. <laughs> I'd be that guy. <laughs> Just like, yeah, I finished. Oh, yeah. She's not going to stay there. Fuck it. Oh, she's going to do a good deed. See, Alyssa's got a bit of niceness in her. Daddy! Where have you been? Thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. Don't do that again. Oh, the good deed. <laughs> I respect her for doing that. I knew she was probably long gone, but it seemed important to try. I'll see if she'll come back. Aww. Oh. James is a cutie, really. James would be shitting himself right now. I wonder what he's doing. I love how they're thinking of each other, even far away. <laughs> the top biscuits. Give me some short, red man. Got a boyfriend? Thanks. Give me my biscuits. <laughs> what a nice guy. Thanks. Stop stealing. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> I know she just does it straight away. Voila. Je regarde les autres. Should we go back to the restaurant? Yeah, she's thinking of James. Go back for him. <laughs> yes. Did she go back? Oh, please, James, still be there. Yes. <laughs> I love it. They waited for each other. It's so romantic. I'm sorry I left you. I'm sorry I killed him. I won't leave you again. <laughs> well, okay. we've got three episodes, so it still could happen. We're back in business, boys. Not a weird one. <laughs> Oh, we got a murder weapon. So what? That was the best episode so far. Really enjoyed that one. That was adorable. <laughs> There's not too much to say. Probably pretty much straightforward. But they reunited, and I thought that led to a good moment at the end. And yeah, just sort of escalating with the crime stuff in the background. Glad they thought about that sort of escalation into it. 
But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe, guys. And hope to see you in next week. Peace.